The movement was begun by a scientist who discovered, quite by accident, these signals being sent. Please understand, they are safe as long as they are not discovered. They want the weapon. Look out for Charlie. Oh, I want that son of a bitch bitch. I want him dead. All right, this is part two of some incident at a concert. If you haven't watched the first part, go back and watch the first part that I released in my last video. In this episode, we are going over the audio. And when I'm talking about the audio, I'm not talking about what you can hear with your ear. I'm talking about what is within the higher frequencies and the ELF frequencies that you can't hear. What that means is that if I find any type of human communication, it shouldn't be there unless people have learned how to talk like bats or submarines. Now, if you can bring me somebody who can talk in the frequencies of bat sonar or talk in the frequencies that submarines communicate, I would love to meet them. What I used was the 30 seconds from the seizure video. That's it. I'm going to get into more of it. But it took me a long time just to tweak out the frequencies from this video alone and get through this 30 seconds. And, you know, in my last video, I went through everything, spelled it out, told people about the active denial system and the frequencies it uses. And there was still that one guy, you know, that, that came along and said, oh, like, what? Like, you know, trying to be cool. You know, in this day and age, the 21st century, if you don't know about frequencies and what's going on, you're not cool trying to sound like butthead. You know, oh, what? Huh. You sound like the way they depicted ignorant hillbillies 50, 60 years ago. That's what you sound like now when you say things like that. And it's just ridiculous. You sound like an ignorant fuck. I could just put a link underneath it, active denial system. And if you think it's non-lethal, if the people that have invented it haven't invented lethal frequencies, you're an idiot. You're just an idiot. So, let's get to the audio. So, in this 30-second clip, I found 12 comments. It's a conversation going back and forth. And it sounds like they're talking about two different things. Towards the end, it changes. The subject changes a little bit. And then it goes back to the original subject on the last line. Now, who knows what else was going on? If somebody had a phone recording of the whole show, it would take a while, but I could get through it and show you what was going on, the communication going back and forth. Some of this is way clearer than it is others, and I'm going to tell you that a couple of these were very hard to figure out. Uh, two and four were especially hard to figure out what they were saying. Some of them are very clear to me. Now, don't use your phone to listen to this. You're going to need headphones or good speakers, earbuds, anything besides that crappy tweeter on your phone. And it's really good to have a woofer that pushes mid-range, like low mids. Because the way this audio comes through, it's just very bizarre. For those of you who are new to this, it is just a bizarre sounding audio. The voices sound robotic. Robotic, sing-songy, yet monotone at the same time because they're following a pulsed beat. That's the way they project. And I'm sure that they don't sound that way when you have a receiver that is designed to pick up this audio, but that's the way they sound when they're picked up with a recorder. All recorders catch evidence because this stuff is a physical vibration that can be caught. So they're always picked up. You have evidence even if you can't hear it. The trick is getting it and pushing it up. So let's start because this is some really, really messed up stuff. As I said in the beginning, there are 12 lines. And the first line is a voice that says it's killing them. It's the first line. I'll play it once because it can get right past you unless it's Luke. So let's listen to it one time. So it says... It's killing them. So let me loop that from here. And again, these voices, they're not supposed to be here. They can't be in these frequencies. A normal human voice cannot be in these frequencies. Once again, it's killing them. Repeated.
It's killing them. It's killing them. Then you have a second voice that sounds like it says there's not that many, but this one is very warped. This operator's voice is the same voice in two as it is in four. And it, the voice is very, like, real low and strange. It, and it almost sounds like it's going backwards. But it says there's not that many. That's what it sounds like to me. Because the third line really backs that up. It's, it sounds like it says there's not that many. I'll loop it. There's not that many. And this took three days of listening to this. So that's what I think it is, but I'm not positive on that. Now, when we get to this one, this is the line that gets clearer. Just like it's killing them. Let's give it a whirl. It says, I'll just stop if there's too many. I'll just stop if there's too many. Let's loop, I'll just stop. And there's frequencies underneath that, that these voices ride on. So you have to realize that it can be very hard for people that can't follow, you know, a particular guitar, horn, or instruments within a mess of music to hear these sometimes. They might hear another noise that's in the background inflect up and think that's a, a different word or a different syllable than it actually is. Where this person is saying, I'll just stop. And then, if there's too many. Let me loop that. If there's too many. So it's kind of like that monotone sing-songy. I'll just stop if there's too many. Now, I didn't know what I was going to find in this. I'm not aiming to find anything. This is what showed up, and this is what I was finding. Let me play you a different version of that, where it says, I'll just stop if there's too many. Back to the original we were listening to, I'll just stop if there's too many. All right, so then moving on, that was the third line out of this. So what you have here is at the beginning, it's the same operator's type voice that sounds low, low mid voice, and it sounds like it's almost going backwards. And then, but then it changes right at the end and it sounds like it says something like emergency well here's where it gets really messed up because it says after that line another voice comes in and says there's too many it says there's too many There's too many. And there's frequencies underneath that, carrying that. So don't be confused by that. You have to follow the higher voice. It sounds like it's saying, there's too many. There's too many. So the whole time, they've been talking about numbers after it's killing them. It's all been about numbers. There's not that many. I can stop if there's too many. There's too many here. And then, here's where it gets really crazy. Listen to this. Okay, that can get right past somebody. What somebody's saying there is, this is fucked up. This is fucked up. That's what they're saying. Listen to it. This is fucked up. This is fucked up. 
They're saying this is fucked up. I've listened to it for three days, and that's the one that stood out right away. It, it took very little tweaking and very little boosting. It was right there, and it just said, this is fucked up. And again, no human frequencies can be here unless you're a bat or a submarine. Now let's go to the next line. Let's listen to it one time. <laughs> Okay, that can get by somebody. Listen to it one more time. Now these are always monotone, always following a beat. So it's like, detected. What if I'm detected? Because that's what it says. What if I'm detected? Let's loop it. What if I'm detected? So there's what if I'm. Now here is detected. Loud and clear. And you can hear the low frequency rumble underneath that's carrying these frequencies. There's a carrier wave, a physical carrier wave. So, detected. Let's do, what if I'm detected? Let's loop the whole thing again. What if I'm detected? So, what if I'm detected? Too many. I can stop if there's too many. There's too many. What if I'm detected? And then the next one, let's give it a listen. Okay, that one has a lot of frequencies underneath it. Sounds like he's saying, I don't think it's possible. I don't think it's possible. I don't think it's possible. So you have to listen to that one voice and follow it and not stray, let your ears stray into those other frequencies. You have to hone in right on that one. And he says, I don't think it's possible. That's possible. So, I don't think it's possible. What if I'm detected? I don't think it's possible. Now the line afterwards, let's hone in on it. It says, this dude detected it. This dude detected it. This dude detected it. I'll just loop detected it. It's sort of a low mid voice talking. Detected it. Then this dude detected it. I'll loop the whole thing again. I don't know who they're talking about, but they're saying this dude detected it. Now see, these all correlate and they line up together. Where normally, when you pick up this signal, there's a lot of random lines. It's like a long run-on sentence. Where this one seems to be straight up conversation going back and forth. Now, after they say this dude detected it, here, this line says, that's what this group is saying. That's what this group is saying. I'm going to play it once. That's what this group is saying. That's what this group is saying. I'll loop, that's what this group. And then I'll loop, is saying. That's what this group is saying. Loop the whole thing. So it's, it, the conversation changes, these, last, these two lines, three lines here. Uh, that's what this group is saying. This dude detected it. That's what this group is saying. Then they're saying a voice comes in who 
doesn't sound like any of the last three or four voices comes in and says the founder I believe it's the founder needs to go I'm gonna play it one time the founder needs to go now either way either way I could be wrong about a word here or a word there either way this communication should not be here now this last line is the kicker it is the real kicker and it lines up with the first line and it sounds like the same transmission and they it's this isn't what somebody really sounds like each person is using a different beat and you can kind of tell who's talking back and forth I will play them together after we play this last one all right so this line is pretty messed up I'm gonna play it one time okay that could get right past somebody you need to focus on the frequencies that are there it says I've because this doesn't sound like normal human inflection it never does it says I've killed a bunch of sick people I'm gonna loop it I killed a bunch of sick people. Now let me loop killed a bunch of sick people. Killed a bunch of sick people. So it says I've killed a bunch of sick people. Now let me go back to the I've. I've killed a bunch of sick people. I've killed a bunch of sick people. And because this stuff rides on pulsed communication, it's very hard to detect. It's very hard to find. What you can't do, and they're going to bring in the rats on this one, what you can't do is say that these voices are just there. They can't be just there. So if we go back to the beginning, the frequencies that make up this voice, it says it's killing them. It's killing them. Is the same frequencies and almost the same pitch as I've killed a bunch of sick people. So in the whole thing there are 12 lines and in these 12 lines it says it's killing them and then another voice says there's not that many and then the other voice says I'll turn it off if there's too many and then another voice is garbled here but sounds like it says emergency then the next voice says there's too many then the next voice says this is fucked up in fact I'll loop this is fucked up one more time so this is fucked up and then the next voice says what if I'm detected the next voice says I don't think that's possible and then another voice says this dude detected it and then the next voice says that's what this group says the next voice says the founder needs to go and then the last voice says I've killed a bunch of sick people go back and listen to them all make sure you listen to them on good headphones or decent speakers not a phone tweeter now I've done analysis of these frequencies and these conversations for a long long time and these are some strange audio anomalies going on in this and they should not be here I've heard two different conversations three different even four different conversations going on at the same time with these and that's what this appears to be it appears to be one conversation up until the what if I'm detected part and uh, 
this dude detected it. That's what this group uh, said, or that's what this group says. And uh, then it goes back to the original conversation. It appears that there are two conversations going on. Now, why is this communication here? And I've talked about this before a lot, but this is uh, nefarious communication, and it's used for a, a myriad of different reasons. But the reason why they use this communication during these types of operations is because it's not monitored by any agency. If you get on a CB, a ham radio, shortwave, anything, it is going to be picked up and monitored by signals intelligence. They are not monitoring this. It's a physical signal. It's very strange physical vibrational signal. Almost like a can in a string, if you can imagine that. And that's the reason why they use this communication is because it's not picked up. The same type of communication is used to attack individuals with because it's a vibrational communication. There are some strange anomalies here. I will get back to you as I go along and check out more audio and see what else I can find. You can't make up excuses for this. These voices should not be here in these frequencies. All right. Look out for Charlie.